At this point in time, we knew that there was two deer in front of us, but we didn't know how big or if they were even bucks. So Steve took off his shoes and snuck 10 yards above the hill in front of me to see what there was. He turned back and said that there was two bucks sitting in front of him and we had a waiting game going on. I slowly turned around, took my boots off, and tried to creep up as quiet as we could. As I was taking my boots off, the two bucks that were only 25 yards in front of Steve slowly started feeding away. They weren't spooked by us, but they knew something was up. Once I reached Steve, we sat down and waited an extra 25 minutes to make sure the deer weren't going to run away on us. We then snuck into another 80 yards and made a game plan. We now had the bucks feeding away from us at 80 yards. What would happen next neither of us knew was possible. Steve took off his shoes and slowly crept in as I sat back with the binoculars and camera and tried to watch it unfold. sat down next to those bucks and they never busted us but they moved out so we snuck back up and there he was again about 80 yards. Steve took off his shoes and went after him. Big old double cheaters. Both left and right side. He's already stripped his velvet. Right you just killed a freaking giant! <laughs> Holy sh! Oh, oh on, Steve! Oh my gosh! Oh. <laughs> Holy crap! Oh my gosh! Oh. 
Dude, you gotta be kidding me. Who's Steve! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Dude, that's a freaking toad! No way with the struggle stick. With the strength. Steve! Stalker stick bow, baby. Oh my gosh, dude. Right there, I told you double kickers. Yeah. Holy crap. Yeah. Oh. Did you like that? Oh, Steve. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh, watch that broadhead coming through. Holy crap. Dude, guys, look at this beer. That's 200, Steve. That's it's pushing. It's to be close. Oh it's, my gosh. It, it's, it's not, but I don't care. Hey, Steve, how many deer you shot with your bow? One. What kind of bow is it? Stalker, dude. Freaking struggle stick, guys. Borrowed it from Dallas Haymire. Okay. Thanks, Dallas. We saw this buck about 100 yards back and had to stand up for, what, 25 minutes? Yeah. yeah. And he just stood there. Just stood there and we couldn't get a shot. Look at that, my gosh. Oh, my man. gosh. Yes. Oh. yes. Oh, was that the big crash? I heard him falling down. <laughs> I thought it was you walking towards me pissed off. I'm like, Dallas, bring her up. <laughs> So oh, bring me my, my boots. I got you, these stickers. You kill the freaking stud. Look at that buck. Yeah. Oh. oh shoot, dude. <laughs> that did not just happen. Six. Holy crap. Six plus six plus the little extras that you can't count. Dude, oh, that didn't dude, just happen. <laughs> oh, Dude, we watched that buck for 25 minutes. Steve was, what, 25 yards away and couldn't get a shot? Mm -hmm. And then we watched him feed over and Steve went ninja style on him. <laughs> Took off his boots and I stood there just helpless and watched dude. him. Yeah, oh my gosh. Head, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy crap, dude. You gotta be kidding me. Take a look at that. Stalker stick bows. Old aluminum arrows. These arrows kicked my butt 10 years ago and I still have them. And 10 I'm years. Killing a, I'm killing a buck, I'm gonna start I'm gonna start again, I'm gonna kill something with a dick stick bow. Oh my gosh, and you did it. I did it. I sat back there just shaking, dude, because I could see his horns and I seen that little, you know, little guy with him. I'm like, and then I hear this crash, and I'm like, oh dude, something happened, you're crashing back. <laughs> Bring me my boots, and I'm like, what's he yelling for? He must have just missed and been all mad. You freaking don't tumble. Dude, that was 20 I yards from where up, you were. I had to go up to the, I had to go up to the log so you wouldn't see him walking oh over. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh, you killed a freaking giant. Public land. This is our first time in here. Yeah. First time. We just crept real slow. The places to hunt are the ones I've never been to. That's true. This is our first time being in here. No. Oh. I was just sitting over there eating all of Steve's Slim Jims. <laughs> and now we just killed the freaking giant buck. Yeah! Oh my gosh. Yes! Dude, oh, yes. yes. Coming, buddy. oh, that's so priceless. September 7th. September? Yep. Go for it. I've had a monkey on my back with a traditional bow forever. Hung with one forever and had a bad experience and I quit about 10 years ago. Maybe a little bit even even more than that. And broke it out last year with the kids and just something to do. Um, and uh, decided that I'm gonna kill something with a, with a... I can't believe I've killed this buck, so we're... I'll come help This has been head. a monkey on my back for probably 12 years. I've quit for 10 of those 12 years trying, but uh, decided I was gonna do it and I got it done, man. Lucky, lucky, lucky. What a buck to start out with, too. <laughs> oh, <laughs> dude, that stalker stick bow. I borrowed Dallas Amire stalker because I shot it so much better than my traditional bow. And uh, man, I'm glad I did. But uh, snuck right in on him, had Sawyer. I wish I could have brought you in, Sawyer, but shoot, dude, it was. <laughs> Ninja style going in, snuck right in and I stayed shot back him. and ate his Slim Jims. 
So he ate all my candy and all my Slim Jims, but I thought uh, thought he was 25, I thought he was 30 yards and shot over him the first time and was able to crouch down and notch another one and pounding the second shot he ran down and died right in front of me. So pretty cool, <laughs> pretty cool. <laughs> Heck of a buck. Heck of an experience. <laughs> We ever been to this canyon before, Steve? Nope, never been here before in my never life. Never stepped foot. My favorite places are the ones I've never been. Oh, oh way to go, dude. Thanks, Sawyer. Six by six. Finally shot me a non-typical. I've got, you know, bucks with trash and cheaters, but I wouldn't consider him a non-typical. I'd consider him with, you know, two extras per side, non-typical. Oh Roman nose, get that Roman nose. Cool buck, Sawyer. Thanks for Heck being here. Heck of an experience. What are we doing, Steve? We're getting to the truck, sorry, we're getting close. What are we, probably about 500 yards now? Yeah, pretty darn got close. More. Got some timber to go through, some yep. fall, but. We got a little bit of meat left, haul out, and big old deer on the back. <laughs> awesome, man. Can't beat it. No. Hey, Steve. Uh, just shot a pump again, fuck. <laughs> I've had that monkey on my back for a long time, so we're gonna blasted him off tonight. <laughs> oh, man. Where, uh, where are you keeping him? Right there. Where else would you put him? You don't put a buck like that on the back. No, <laughs> sir. Tried to put him in the car seat, but he wouldn't fit, so we <laughs> went ahead and let him sit in the middle there. Might want to put a seat belt on him, huh? Five and six inches to the cutoff line on the G1. <laughs> Holy heck. <laughs> Twenty-one and three quarters. Twenty and four eighths, so he'll get cheated out of an inch on his inside spread credit, but I don't care, man. He's a freaking stud. This was a buck of a lifetime. It was on public ground in a place that we'd never been or never scouted. Some people say Steve will never beat it, but I can guarantee you one thing, he'll give it hell trying.